and our merciful God is fighting for us daily. He never sleeps. He, he never sleeps. He, he, he always keeps our safe, safe, good and classified. Yeah. Now, and now the children say, Santa keeps our sin, our classified sins. He never sleeps. He knows when you are awake or asleep. Now, if my Lord w would, would ever betray me, I would still forgive him. You, you all of us have betrayed him multiple times. Mm -hmm. Every day, someone betrays him. And he, he, he just sits there. Now, that's to explain the power of our Lord that you can do anything through his graceful, mightyful power. You can, you walk each time because of his power. When the, when the devil did damn terrible things in heaven, the Lord sent, the Lord sent him down over to earth. In a, and then he became a form of a snake and he tempted Eve. Now, Eve took the temptation thinking that the, that the food that she will eat will make him like the Lord, see whether it was good or evil. And Adam, Adam was not there at that time. And when, when I was very young, no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not putting all the women over here. I was so young. Okay. I, 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 I used to say, I used to say, uh, you see what the women did to all of us. I wish we'd been working all of us in the corner of Eve, doing our own things. But now the woman, they, they just a woman, one woman <laughs> had to eat that for never all over here. I'm sorry, that I thought. So I, I didn't, I, I didn't actually love that story a lot. <laughs> and and if God is powerful, he, in time, in in time, in the times of trouble, he's still there with you. But comes the day of judgment. Ah, you're answering your own lips. <laughs> you you be right there answering to all your sins you've done. And I and I know I've done multiple sins. I know that. I won't list them. <laughs> I've I have done multiple sins myself. And maybe all of you have done sins. May, even I always say even a baby dancing. You get out the stomach, you cry for no reason. And then the mother like, ah, why are you crying now? Why are you crying? But I understand, first time seeing the light. Now, if, if all, if now if all of us, if all of us, okay, now in wars, in some time that the devil was a bullet to all of us. He was a threat, a bullet coming straight to us. But guess who was a bulletproof? Our God, Jesus. When the Lord, when Satan was a knife, who was our sword? Amen. Amen. Our, our Lord Jesus Christ. And uh, I don't know where this verse is located. I forgot. I don't know where it's found, but it said that I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Oh, you can do everything through His multiple, mighty power that I also know that we're not compared to him but he loves us all with such great might he would even die for us and i, I and if i i don't know anyone who would die for anyone they love because i don't i i'll tell the truth i'm not sure i would die for anyone i love <laughs> now even even over here you do to do, do, do come to church just just, just for the sake I say, uh, we have to go to church because we, 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 uh, you, you, can't, you can't even think that we're just coming to church because the Lord said so. Some, I, some people, actually, I, I, I used to come sometimes, some, uh, when my, oh man, I used to come to church with, I'm um, like, I'm cheerful at each church, like the, it's weekend, I go to church, I sit in front, listen, listen to the pastor. Most of them used to inspire me so, like, a lot. They inspired me so much that I also wanted to be one of them. And I said to myself that one day I'll be the one. I'll be the one behind this table. And as, as my dad, my dad also used to be a preacher, my dad. I always just confront, like, we get in church. First thing I get in church, I go to church, see maybe a seat. 
Maybe like, yeah, like this one, then this is him preaching over here. Yeah, then I, I used to sit over there and see him preach to me and seem to preach every time. And most most of the most of the people I've been with have inspired me saying that I can do this and I can do everything that everyone over here. I'm okay now I'm looks like I'm just doing an inspiration speech about my topic that the Lord loves us all. Amen. I wanna ask you back to my first question before I even when I study over here. Amen. What what do you understand when I say when, when they say God loves you all? And it's a question. So like, it's a new question. What is your understanding? <laughs> Anyone? <laughs> Died for me. Yeah, the Lord did. The Lord did die for Jesus Christ. The the mighty Jesus Christ died for us, all of us on the cross. If if I was on the cross, I'll be crying for the my life. I wouldn't even let them touch me. <laughs> God, God's power is so. It, God. Power God is very is very phenomenal. If I would say he's he's so he's so unique and advanced and all of us all of us in life we all have an advantage because our Lord is there. He's right there. We we all of us may just think saying that how the, we all us pray and I think God is have been saying the Lord has forsaken me. He has something very he has something planned for you in the future. He always has a plan for you. Because you, because he makes us say, you say, you just say, I want gold. He gives you silver. Even though you wanted gold, you want, um, what else do you want? You want, you want paper money, like the riches. He gives you multiple coins. <laughs> Even now, now you have to go to the bank and, yeah, continue to money. And my my God and all your God, all of you. His I he I keep him over here. I always keep him in my heart, right there. It, it's always in my memory. And I before I sleep every day, I just go to the blanket, pray first, and then I sleep. If all of all of us would just be like God, let's just be like God. How do you think this world would be? If all of us were just a God, Jesus Christ, and our our Lord is so merciful. He forgave all our sins and continued. If a person, would, if a, that's what I would need my child, if I, in his through his veins nailing him, I would, and he just he still comes there. Our Lord with his wounded fingers to hug us all. He, he he was and when. That this I, for, I forgot her name, but it was another woman with very long, so long hair. Jesus was was sitting down on his chair. The he, the woman came for forgiveness for all her sins, and he she cut her hair was the Jesus feet. And if if all of you were in the position, was in the position. Of our Lord Jesus Christ how like what would you do in that position what would you do in that in that spot what would you all do because he he sits there saying for 24 7 that he loves us all every week of our 21 centuries the Lord was there saying he loves us all we were the Lord did do powerful stuff if if you can't if you can't like if you can't walk you when the lord passes you you can walk if you die the lord will pick you up when you're on the floor life is on top of you rocks of sinful devils and life everything is on top of you the lord will remove those rocks and pick you up clean you when you're dirty jesus christ has came here once and will come here again Amen. to take all these people who are trembling, who are trembling in sorrow, and people of their love are dying around them. 
the Lord will take them all. He will take the good people. But I'm starting to believe that I think it was first term of school. Uh, yeah, I think we were closing. You know, like we we're nearby closing. Guess what happened to me? I broke my leg. Damn. I was, I was like so much in pain that day. I, I, I even got carried by a seven all the way downstairs. My leg was so painful. Then you say, I mean, the windows will break. Okay. Then I just take it once, once, only once. I won't do it again. Amen? Amen! I think the windows has got insurance right now. <laughs> so, back to talking about I was single, now I think I'm there, now I go offline with what I was saying. Okay. That's how powerful he is. He learned, he, he's put on this table, everyone, even, even people in South Korea will say, oh, that's how powerful he loves us all. He's, he's so big, he keeps this whole world in his hand. Yeah, and one well, one well, well, of the believe that say, okay, let's fight to space this year. There will be nobody, of course. Because that's how powerful he is. His might, his might, it reigns forever. And he's maybe, I stopped, like, um, I used to, when I was young, I used to believe that, yeah, Spider-Man is my hero. Okay. Spider-Man. But now that, when I'm old, that I know that, the Lord is my hero. He's my savior. He's the person who keeps me moving each day. The person who makes me motivates me, mentors me, stand up, and just don't give up. He's the one. He inspires me. And if he if he inspires you all, raise your hand. He inspires me forever. Yeah. Plus, I even have a boss over here. Before I run out of time, um, can would I love um, anyone to read for me John three verse sixteen? Amen. I'm even reading. I'm even looking for it. Amen. <laughs> but if you get the first, just say amen because I won't be actually looking. <laughs> Amen. Should I read? Yeah. It says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. We can read to that again. Uh, it's so like that the people from behind came in hearing. <laughs> All the way there. They know the best. No, yeah, no. but for now. Okay, for now. Okay. It's, uh, I'm reading. On John chapter 3, verse 16, it says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten ah, son. Ah, yeah, wait, that he gave his only begotten son. Yeah. Only one, only one son he had, had to come down there and be wow. nailed. Mm. If, 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 if we were here for kids, we would just say to all of them, who will choose to go down there? <laughs> if he was a children, to get a children, to get nailed there, and put a crown. I'd be like, if I, and I'd be like, no one will even answer. I would even say no. I would do that. Those people don't even, those people don't even know they're strangers. <laughs> even some, some of the people... Yeah, I can sit down. Even some of the people that... They don't, when the Lord was crazy, carrying his cross all the way to Mount Calvary, some people were spitting at him. And who knows why we woke up with the people there. Remember the wooden is quite all over here. <laughs> <laughs> I, I wouldn't even want that, but some but Simon had to just just take the cross of the of the Lord and carry it all the way to Mount to Calvary. And he carried the cross with blood gushing over him. I'm sure he left a tree with like bills of blood while he was walking carrying that cross. No one saw him over here. And I'm sure no one saw when he when he was carrying the cross. And if anyone did, man, they are all. If anyone did, so he carried it, the cross all the way. There. After a, a whooping, those waves are like they almost like a sound bar, but then they that they, they were more painful than sound bars. It's like those sound bars, but these ones are actually weak. If you whoop someone from there with the sound bar, you'll be like, oh, that's okay, my each bra. 
Just, but then, they were whipped. when they whipped him and took it out, meat came out with it and blood started gushing out. I don't know how many lashes they gave him, whip by whip. And then, and then he then he carried the the cross all the way to Mankaro. But before all that happened that day, he had Israel like his followers. Oh Simon Peter, P, oh Simon Peter, John, and all of them. They were with the Lord before that day, but one of them betrayed him. A human betrayed him. I wouldn't even think of betraying a mighty person. They betrayed him. The Lord asked them one test. Would you please stay up with me for the night? Mm. But they didn't listen. Mm. Oh, poor Lord, they didn't listen. <laughs> he, he, he went there to, the, to pray. He prayed. He went back. They were asleep. They were, they were, they were from, I think they were first like, okay, he prayed. He came back to were sleeping. He wakes them up and asks them, would you please stay up with me? He went. He came back to sleeping. Third time, I don't think he stayed up, he left them. And then, since they didn't listen, the people came and took him right under their nose. The other was just saying, uh, no, don't make me fall. He was just snoring and sleeping as big, big men who were with him. And if they were if, if, if expecting power from the Lord, saying, I got them all power to stay up with them, well, well, life gave them another thing. So they took the Lord with there, and after that, they whipped him and put him all through the torture. They need him like this, maybe for a day. I wouldn't, I wouldn't sleep like I wouldn't even try. I'm sure, I'm sure when I wake up, I'll be stroked like this. <laughs> and then, then after the written over here, the king of Jews. Well, even we still call the king after my body, and I'm really left with my underwear, and it's maybe a little bit of winter, and and well, right, right there, I'm sure, I'm sure. I'll be crying until saying, well, well, actually, if I didn't know, and I didn't know anything, like I'd be like, wow, what a poor man. They're whipping him like this, and I wonder what he did. And some people who didn't know him, so say, I'm sure this guy is a 